Hi everyone, Scott Weaver with Designers Workroom. So today we're going to go over why you should never hang your drapery rods on your moldings or just above your moldings. Well the first good reason is because when you're hanging a rod on your molding, you're still going to see the side of your molding when you look at the side view of it. But we're going to go over many, many different scenarios to show you exactly where your rod should be. Now I get it. When you're hanging, especially when it's a large window, you're installing your rod on the molding means that your molding's already there. It gives you a nice level spot. It's wood, so you don't have to use mollies, etc. So it's the easiest place to put it, but it doesn't look so hot. So we're going to explain to you how to do it right. So the type of rod that you normally would see would be either a traverse rod or just a regular um, rod for a rod pocket or even poles. I also see a lot of people with poles and they put that pole right there just above the molding. And it's really the wrong place. Let's take a look at some scenarios to show you where they should be properly installed. Thanks for watching. room the window trait bins are installed too low there's too much space between the ceiling and where the valance is it also makes the window look squattier now this is actually hung about four inches above the molding so it's not awful bad but imagine if this was hung on the molding like a lot of people do it would really look awful but my suggestion is to go up higher make your windows look taller when you so here is a very good example of where you should hang your valance and your draperies. Your draperies should go out so it almost clears the entire window. That is, um, would be a great proportion. You also, your valance should go up higher, making sure that you have about four inches before it hits your ceiling. Hanging to the ceiling really doesn't do much for you unless you have very low ceilings, then you have to. However, Having a little bit of wall space above is great, but you don't want to hang things on your molding. Hanging on your molding brings your ceiling to look down farther, um, it, it makes your window look shorter, and having your draperies in your window also makes your window look smaller. The idea, especially if you're trying to sell your home, the idea is when you walk into it, your home, that your windows look bigger. When you When your windows look bigger, your room looks bigger, your ceilings look higher. Put them up a little higher. If you only have just a balance, hang that up higher, like 4 inches. Of course, if your balance is only like 10 or 12 inches, you may not have the room to do that. Understandable. But if you're making them yourself, make them a little deeper, go up a little higher. In this room, we have a decorative pole with just side panels, stationary side panels. This is the correct height. You'll notice it is a little bit closer to the ceiling and not so far down towards the molding. If this was hung down towards the molding, it would do two things. It would make your ceilings look lower and it would also make your windows look squatty. So this is the ap appropriate place that you should be hanging a pole. Um, sometimes up too close to the ceiling isn't good because it, it put your eye too far up and you have too much wall space between where the pole is and where your uh, your window is. So proportionately 
you want to split the difference but probably go up a little higher towards the ceiling but not all the way up to the ceiling like you see a lot of people do I don't really care for all that wall space personally for, for myself the other thing that we have going on here which is great is that the pole extends way past the window that makes your window look larger and also doesn't block your view I've had to close the wood blinds because if I open them up then hey, you wouldn't be able to see anything here but I want you to show you where the window now that is right where the window frame is so you can see this is going past it by about 10 inches each side making your room look much wider I also want to point out one other thing about this pole a lot of people do not put the uh, return you see this is what's called the return and that's going back to the wall a lot of people take an extra ring w ring and put it on the pole but it does not give you a great side view this has a great side view because you can't see and it returns all it has is a little tender hook um, or you can put a screw high and return that last end to the wall it looks so much nicer and cleaner when you do that now in this room this room unfortunately has this up here which is part of the ductwork let me just push this up just a little higher okay so that's the ductwork up here so unfortunately the window starts about an inch um, below this ceiling right here so the only place you could put the valance is right right on top of the molding so that's not the best look now I'm going to want to also swing my camera over in this room there's two of these windows one like this that there's ductwork on the other side there is no ductwork I want you to take notice of how short and squatty this window looks and then when I swing the camera over you can see how much longer the window looks and that will give you a good, a good example of, of why you should bring your, your rods up a little higher so here's the second window in the room and you notice that the ceiling of course is at the regular height and again we only have about four inches of ceiling showing and this is making the window look much taller and of course with the draperies uh, side panels it makes it much wider so there's a second example of of why you should bring your rods up we're going to go to another room so in this window it's the same deal as in the other room because they have this ledge up here the, the window is a very squatty window and it's actually a very small window so if you look at it you can tell that we've also here again we've only have about four inches of space above the ceiling we have brought the valance down enough and out and that is what's making our window look so much taller So just kind of remember that when you're hanging your drapery rods or your valances, make sure you're going up and out. Thanks for watching. Scott Weaver with Designers Workroom.